If you find yourself having to press Control alt delete on your computer when you start it up before you see the login screen, in this video I'll show you how to get rid of that requirement. Now there are a number of reasons why you might be required to do that, and usually it's because your computer is either part of a business network or used to be part of a business network. And there are some cases where your system administrator might have disallowed you from making the changes I'm about to show you. So if you find that these steps don't work, it's probably that you are not allowed to make these changes and there's not much I can do about that. But in all other cases, here are the steps you would use to disable that requirement. So you need to go to local security policy and to do that, click on the start menu and start typing local security and that option will show up. So you click on it to launch that. Now, for some reason, it doesn't show up in the search results. You can also right click on the start menu, go to run, and then type in secpol.msc and press enter. And that will also launch local security policy. So expand the local policy section by clicking the symbol just to the left of it. Then click on security options. Scroll down a bit and you'll see an option there that says do not require control all delete. You'll find that that option is set to either disabled or not defined. And you'll want to double click on that and then change it to enabled and then click OK. And when you restart your computer, you should no longer be required to press control alt delete. If you found this helpful, don't forget to press that like button. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.